Just to finish off with Javadoc, I'd like to show you how you can configure the system to add Javadoc comments automatically to your code. So here's the bubble sort program again, and if I scroll down you can see there's private uh, methods and there's no Javadoc attached to them. There's a very nice tool here under the tools menu that says analyze Javadoc and this will actually produce code in Javadoc format for your code. By default it is not set up to do this for private methods because mainly it's the public and protected methods that need to be documented with Javadoc. However, it's good practice to have Javadoc for all the code. So let's show how you can change the settings. Also under the Tools menu then, at the bottom is the Options menu. If I select this, then up come the Options, and for the Editor, there's an option for Java Doc, which may be turned off by default. If I turn that on, and then open it up, you can see the various options. For example, Create Java Doc here has various settings, and by default, these are set to Protected and public classes. If I select private, it will generate Javadoc for all classes and methods, private or public. While I'm at it, I'll also do the same thing for errors. Change that to private as well. When I OK this, you'll see now that our errors are being thrown for that particular line, and missing Javadoc can be fixed simply by clicking and adding the code. I can now customize that as I wish. In addition to adding through that method, if I delete this, I can also go back to the Tools menu and select Analyze Javadoc. This then produces a list down at the bottom of the screen with all of the errors that need to be addressed. Looking at that, I see I can create the missing Javadoc for that method and that method simply by clicking those two and then fixing the selected. And you can see then if I scroll through the code it's added those settings for that method and that method. Lastly, you can also add Javadoc for a given method like this by simply adding slash star star and when I hit enter it will add automatically for that particular method. So those are the three ways you can add Java doc code in amongst your Java source code.